Hi, I'm David Davis from Actual Tech Media. We're here at the headquarters of Store Centric, and I'm excited to be joined by Mr. Mahir Shah. He is the CEO of the new company, Store Centric. Mahir, how are you doing? David, thanks for having me. Excited for you guys to come to our headquarters and uh, looking forward to giving you an update on Store Centric and what we've been up to. Yeah, me too. So I know our audience might be wondering, you know, who is Store Centric? So let's start off with that. Uh, my mom actually wonders who is store centric as well. <laughs> no, look, we created store centric for uh, really the purpose of creating an organization that's extremely storage focused um, uh, and a high level of customer centricity. Um, and we combined two of the leading brands in the storage industry, which is Drobo and Nexan, to create this parent company. Mm -hmm. And so we're excited to take these products to market uh, to show our customers that, look, we are going to be focused on storage and we're going to be focused on you, the customer. Very nice. So I, I used to be a Drobo user myself. I had a Drobo in my used lab. Used to be? What? I, I need to get a, a new one. That was quite a few years back, but it was a gr it's a great product. Uh, super easy, super simple to install, high performance, supported a lot of protocols. And I'm also familiar with Nexan. Nexan, in my mind, is a, a higher tier enterprise grade product. So what's the purpose in, in combining the two companies together into this new entity? Yeah, you know what we, you know, our, our vision here was when we looked at Nexan uh, and, and combining it with Drobo, we saw that there was, uh, you know, we would walk into the customer's halls and we would see Nexan at the core and Drobo on the edges. And yeah. there was very little... Um, overlap in terms of the user base, mm -hmm. but we saw an overlap in terms of the customers and how they were using the products. And so what, what made sense was to combine these businesses to have them interoperate and uh, integrate with each other. So for example, if you have a large media company that they're backing up their movies on large scale uh, Nexan devices, but the editors are editing them on Drobo devices. And right. so that was really the genesis. You know, the other thing is both uh, products are super easy to use. Mm -hmm. And so the real mission here is we want to make storage easy for people to use. And uh, it made absolute sense. The cultures of both companies integrated very well. We saw the, you know, um, uh, folks were, um, you know, just kind of down to earth and really, really were focused on the customer, which yeah. is, you, 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 it's rare to find these days. People are so focused on buying technology and just buying IP and those types of things that they, they lose sight of the customer. Yeah. So like Google's Alphabet company, yep. StoreCentric is kind of the, the broad, high-level brand that's going to join these two companies together. But the two companies aren't going away. Is that right? Exactly. Look, uh, we have our, you know, Nexan customers know Nexan. Yeah. Drobo customers know Drobo. Where we see, again, the benefit over here is now Nexan customers have an opportunity to integrate Drobo into their environment. And as the Drobo customers grow, if you think about a small studio who's growing relatively rapidly and mm -hmm. as the data proliferates, uh, you know, they're able to uh, scale into a Nexan type device. Okay, excellent. So for, what's the future of Store Centric? Again, our view is very much customer focused and we are looking at further acquisitions to bolster the portfolio. And again, it's gonna be focused on the segments where we do well. Uh, we're gonna, looking at software acquisitions primarily. And then we do wanna put a wrap around professional services, especially on the higher end things, you know, things like data migrations. You know, how do you interoperate with the cloud? We wanna be the storage experts, right? We don't wanna be just the guys that just sell you a box and then walk away. We wanna be able to get integrated with in your business. We want to be able to help you solve what I think is the most difficult challenge in the next five to seven years is data proliferation. Data is mm. growing at an enormous rate and people just, you know, it's complicated to manage and we want to be able to help them solve for that. That's right. Yeah. Companies are really struggling with, with data and protecting that data and, and companies of all sizes, you know, large companies and small companies are, have the same, you know, similar types of challenges. And so it sounds like you all at StoreCentric are going to be able to meet those needs and, and solve those problems no matter the size of the company. Exactly. And look, we're, 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 we're small, we're agile, we are, you know, we have scale, we're, um, you know, we have uh, over 500,000 units between both companies installed all over the world in 60 plus countries. So, you know, now we have the ability to go and, uh, um, um, you know, help customers all over the world. Excellent. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Mahir. Thank you for having me, David. Appreciate it. For more information, visit storecentric.com.